Oh, I, I, I was standing on the sidelines, in fact, and I was. I mentioned it to one of the other coaches. I said, "It's a. It, it, there's two things that are so impressive when you're standing there: is the way he throws." And the way our receivers catch. Right. I mean, I, it just seems like yeah, I've seen great throws before where a guy just doesn't seem to make it, you know. Or and I, and our guys, and I don't want to jinx them, but they've just done a phenomenal job of catching the football. And I think it's because of his passes. His passes are so good too. And our offensive line does a great job. Right. What's it like to work with this guy? He's tremendous. Yeah. He's tremendous. He, you know. Um, He's he's so experienced for just being the head coach. Right. I mean, Forty years old. Yeah. He um, you come in every day. You want to, you know. And as long as I've coached, when you run into guys like this, that when you come in and you say, "I want to do a great job for him," because he's doing a great job for everybody else. I mean, that's really what he is. I mean, you say to yourself, "Man, this guy's really something." And every day you just come in. Here's what I want done. Here's what I, you know, here's what we got to do, and this is what we do. Do you understand why they went to him last August when Irving got suspended? I mean, there were two head coaches on the staff. They went right to Ryan. Oh yeah, I understand. Yeah. No, <laughs> Greg, speaking about the development of, of Ryan as a head coach, that timeout he called today, you're up, up 14, he called the timeout to pretty much put the stop to a drive that uh, Nebraska had done. But he's been talked to and talked about how the, he's trying to manage the whole game and learn as a head coach. Was that one of those moments where you see a guy who likes, oh, yeah. gets it? Yeah, it was a great. There's a, lot of, there's a lot of head coaches that wouldn't have done that. I mean, he's totally into the whole game. You know, offense, defense, kicking game. It took, it took so long for Jeff to get his first career interception, and then now he's gotten three out in the last two games. Is it just a matter of team, him getting more opportunities, maybe the team's throwing the ball more? Is it something that he's changed? What? What do you think? No, I think it's a, it's a copy a combination of a lot of things. You know, I mean, he's older. He's working really, really hard in practice. He's uh, Jeff. Jeff's done a great job with him. You know, Coach Halfley. I mean, it, it, that whole secondary has done a great job. And uh, and our offensive, our defensive line has gotten great pressure, which which the ball comes out a little different. And so I mean, that's I think possibility. You know? Great. Job. Thanks for watching. Subscribe below to get the latest videos from Letterman Row. We've got Letterman Live, we've got the practice report, we got rapid reaction. Hey, and you know we got Buck IQ with Zach Bourne. For sure. We got recruiting breakdowns with Berm. We got whatever you need. Ohio State football and Ohio State Athletics, we've got you covered here at Letterman Row.